हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल ऑन इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी ओवरव्यू ऑफ द कॉन्सेप्ट कॉल्ड एज पॉइसन डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन वी विल आल्सो सी एग्जांपल्स बेस्ड ऑन इट सो लेट अस फर्स्ट सी व्हाट आर द पॉइंट्स दैट आई एम गोइंग टू कवर इन दिस वीडियो फर्स्ट वी विल सी कंपैरिजन बिटवीन बाइनोमियल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एंड पॉइसन डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन then we will see formal definition of poisson distribution and then we will see examples based on poisson distribution so let us see the comparison between binomial and poisson distribution note that both these distributions binomial and poisson are probability distributions of binary data however they differ in following point binomial distribution is applicable when there are fixed number of trials of random experiment where each trial results in success or failure however poisson distribution is applicable when there could be any number of events that can occur during a certain time interval or in space for example flipping a coin four times is an example of binomial distribution because here number of trials are fixed whereas in an example of counting the number of commuters arriving at the ticket window is an example of poisson distribution because you will never know how many commuters will arrive at the ticket window in an hour therefore this example is example of poisson distribution now let us see formal definition of poisson distribution a random variable x is said to follow poisson distribution if it represents the number of events occurring in a fixed interval of time or space the probability mass function of a poisson random variable x is given by p of x equal to x is equal to e raised to minus lambda into lambda raised to x upon x factorial where x takes values 0 1 2 and so on it denotes the number of occurrences of an event and lambda is an average number of occurrences in the interval the average number of occurrences per unit time are usually given by n into p where n is number of trials and p is the probability of success we denote np as lambda note that mean and variance of poisson distribution are both same they are given by lambda and value of lambda is nothing but n into p i hope you understood this definition of poisson distribution now we proceed for examples based on poisson distribution in this first example we are given that suppose on an average one house in 1000 in a certain district has a fire during a year if there are 2000 houses in that district what is the probability that exactly five houses will have a fire during the year let us proceed for solution we define a random variable x which denotes the number of houses that will have fire during the year because we wanted to find the probability that exactly five houses will have a fire during the year so we are denoting x which denotes the number of houses that will have fire during the year since there are 2000 houses in consideration here n will become 2000 since number of trials are large x should follow poisson distribution also note that we have to find the probability that these houses will have fire during the year so here time interval is given to find the probability so this x will follow definitely poisson distribution given that on an average one house in 1000 in a certain district has a fire during a year therefore probability that a house will get a fire during the year that is probability of success p is 1 by 1000 therefore mean lambda is given by n into p n is 2000 p is 1 by 1000 therefore lambda is 2 now we define the poisson distribution applicable over here pmf here will be 
P of X is equal to E raised to minus lambda into lambda raised to X upon X factorial. Here lambda is 2. So this PMF becomes E raised to minus 2 into 2 raised to X upon X factorial. Now using this PMF, we will find the probability that exactly 5 houses will have fire during the year. Probability that exactly 5 houses will have fire during the year will be denoted by P of X is equal to 5. And using this PMF, we can write P of X equal to 5 as E raised to minus 2 into 2 raised to 5 upon 5 factorial. After using calculator, you can write P of X is equal to 5 as 0 0.036. So this is the probability that exactly 5 houses out of 2000 will have fire during the year. I hope guys you understood this example. Now let us proceed for next one. In this example, we are given that if 2% of electric bulbs manufactured by a certain company are defective, then find the probability that in a sample of 200 bulbs, number 1, less than 2 bulbs are defective and number 2, more than 3 bulbs are defective. Let us proceed for solution. First, we define a random variable x. Let random variable x denote the number of defective bulbs in the sample. Since a sample of 200 bulbs is under consideration to calculate the probability, here n will be equal to 200. Since n is too large or number of trials are too large, x follows Poisson distribution. Now we will calculate the corresponding mean lambda of Poisson distribution. It is given by n into p. n we have already calculated. Now we have to calculate probability of success p. To find out p, look at the question. It is given that 2% of electric bulbs manufactured by a certain company are defective. So here probability of success that is probability that bulbs are defective is 2%. Therefore, P is 2%, that is 2 by 100, that is 0 0.02. Now we have P as well as N, we can calculate mean, that is lambda, given by N into P, that is 200 into 0 0.02, which is 4. Therefore, lambda is equal to 4. Now we write corresponding PMF, probability mass function of this Poisson distribution. It is denoted by P of x equal to x is equal to e raised to minus lambda into lambda raised to x upon x factorial, where lambda is 4. So P of x equal to x is e raised to minus 4 into 4 raised to x upon x factorial. Now we calculate the probability that less than 2 bulbs are defective. It will be given by P of x less than 2. And we know P of X less than 2 is nothing but P of X equal to 0 plus P of X equal to 1. We can calculate P of X equal to 0 using this PMF formula. Therefore, P of X equal to 0 is E raised to minus 4 into 4 raised to 0 upon 0 factorial. And P of X equal to 1 is E raised to minus 4 into 4 raised to 1 upon 1 factorial. After using calculator, you can write P of X less than 2 is 0.0915. This is the probability that less than 2 bulbs are defective. Now we proceed to calculate probability that more than 3 bulbs are defective. Probability that more than 3 bulbs are defective is given by P of X greater than 3, which is nothing but P of X equal to 4 plus P of X is equal to 5 plus P of X is equal to 6 and so on up to p of x is equal to 200. But it is impossible to calculate these 197 values. We will use complement formula. Using complement formula, we can write p of x greater than 3 as 1 minus p of x equal to 0 plus p of x is equal to 1 plus p of x is equal to 2 plus p of x is equal to 3. 
using this PMF formula, we will substitute values for P of x equal to 0 up to P of x is equal to 3 as follows. This is P of x equal to 0. This is P of x equal to 1. Similarly, this is P of x is equal to 2 and 3. Finally, we use calculator to calculate P of x greater than 3. We find it is equal to 0 0.567. So, this is the probability that more than 3 bulbs are defective. I hope guys you understood this answer. Now let's go for next example. In this example, we are given that, assume that the probability of an individual coal miner being killed in a mine accident during a year is 1 over 2400. We are asked to use appropriate statistical distribution to calculate the probability that in a mine employing 200 miners, there will be at least one fatal accident in a year. Let us proceed for the solution. First, we define a random variable. Let random variable x denote the number of fatal accidents in a year. As there are 200 miners employed in a mine, n should be equal to 200. Since number of fatal accidents in a year can be any number, x will follow Poisson distribution. As we have n, we will go to find out p to get lambda, which is mean of this distribution, where p is probability of success. Here success means there is a fatal accident. And given that the probability of an individual coal miner being killed in a mine accident during a year is 1 over 2400, therefore probability of success that is P is 1 over 2400. Now we have N and P, we will go for calculating lambda which is mean whose formula is N into P. So N is 200, P is 1 over 2400, it is equal to 1 over 12. Now we write the corresponding probability mass function P of x equal to x which is given by e raised to minus lambda into lambda raised to x upon x factorial. Here we will substitute lambda is equal to 1 over 12. Now we proceed to find the corresponding probability. The probability that there will be at least one fatal accident in a year can be given by P of x greater than or is equal to 1. And P of x greater than or is equal to 1 can be given by P of 1 plus P of 2 plus P of 3 up to P of 200. But calculating these 12, 200 values is quite impossible. So instead of calculating these 200 values, we will use complement property of probability which says probability of 1 plus probability of 2 up to probability of 200 is equal to 1 minus probability of 0. Probability of 0 can be calculated using this PMF formula. Here we have to substitute x equal to 0. So this is P of 0. Now you can use calculator to calculate this amount. Here we find P of x greater than or is equal to 1 is 0 0.08. So the probability that there will be at least one fatal accident in a year is 0 0.08. I hope guys you understood this solution. Now let us go for next interesting example. Here given that in a certain factory producing cycle tires, there is a small chance of 1 in 500 tires to be defective. The tires are supplied in a lots of 10. Using Poisson distribution, we are asked to calculate the approximate number of lots containing no defective tire in a consignment of 10,000 lots. So let us calculate this. First we define the corresponding random variable. So let x be the corresponding random variable denoting the number of defective tires in a lot. Since there are 10 tires in a lot, n should be equal to 10. As there are 10,000 lots in consideration for calculating probability, this x should follow Poisson distribution. Now, let us calculate probability of success. 
here getting a defective tire indicates a success and given that there is a small chance of 1 in 500 tires to be defective therefore probability of success p is 1 over 500 therefore mean lambda which is n into p is 10 into 1 over 500 which is 0 0.02 now we write corresponding pmf probability mass function which is p of x equal to x is equal to e raised to minus lambda into lambda raised to x upon x factorial here we substitute lambda is equal to 0 0.02 so this is the corresponding pmf now we calculate the probability of getting no defective tire in a lot. It is denoted by P of x equal to 0. P of x equal to 0 can be calculated using this formula by substituting x equal to 0 in this. It can be calculated using calculator. I found P of x equal to 0 is 0 0.9802. So probability that there will be no defective tire in a lot is 0 0.9802 since there are 10,000 such lots the number of lots containing no defective tire can be calculated by simply multiplying 10,000 with this probability therefore number of lots containing no defective tire in a consignment of 10,000 lots is 10,000 into 0 0.9802 which is equal to 9802 therefore there are 9,802 lots out of 10,000 lots that contain no defective tire. I hope guys you understood this solution. Now it is your turn to solve some examples. Below are some examples for you based on Poisson distribution. Their final solutions are also mentioned over here. Guys, please write me in comment box whether you were able to solve these examples or not. Please also write me how much useful this video is for you. In my next video, I will be covering normal distribution. Till then, keep practicing these examples, keep watching my videos. Thank you all of you. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get updates about my new videos.